got myself some breakfast to start the day. And I'm gonna go ahead and lay that back, lay back down in bed and eat my breakfast. Hey girl, you just woke up today too? Yeah, yes you did, yes you did. Well, anyway, obviously to start the day, to start, obviously to start the um, video off, it looks like it's a beautiful Sunday morning today. As yesterday's video was a bit, yesterday morning's video was a bit, was a bit not so. But anyway, to the SS, start the intro, and let's go and talk about a couple of things. SS is coming back to life. Heck yeah. Anyway, anyway, today, today's video is we're like we're not gonna be talking about a couple of things today either. No, you guys saw yesterday we put on a couple of vinyls for the for the C4. We may put on the second one today. I don't know, no, for the C5, but mainly because because the first one we tried for the C5 it did not come off well. I did not, was not, was not able to film that, so we may have to order a, a separate vinyl for the C5. That's just the last thing I want to do. If you guys may notice, I actually changed my profile picture and also my YouTube banner to make to make it be a vlogging type channel look to it. And since I like our, since this channel is mainly 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 based on our cars and stuff like that. As well, I thought I'd go and make the banner be about our cars as well. That's one of the sickest pictures I've ever gotten of our cars. I mean, and I already checked the mail this morning, guys. Well, I have not checked that mail, but the thing is, we did get a package today. We did get a package. I don't know, I don't know what was in there, but I can tell you one thing. It was actually something pretty interesting. It looked like it's something for oil. And I don't know what it was, but we got a little package. We got a pretty big package. I may have to show you guys what we got in the package today. And also, I'm about to go down there right now to be able to actually check the mail. But now, today's video, next to nothing's really planned in today's video, but if we do do something in today's video, I will start recording it. And if not, I'll be ending it very, very soon. But anyway, let's go ahead and grab the keys from outside the door. Do not press the throttle. Anyway, let's go put the keys back. Let's go ahead and go put these keys back in their desired spot. And then we're going to go check the mail, shall I? All right, I'm going to go down here and go check the mail. Hopefully, we got something interesting. I don't know if the mail will even run yet. We never know. If the, like if the post FedEx Postal Service came by, maybe these two guys came by. Nope, they have not came by yet. But don't worry, I will check the mail whenever it gets. Check this out. It's also really windy today as well. Unknowingly, I do not know why, but it's windy. That's all I gotta say. Whoa! Check this out. Whenever I open the door. A little ring formed when I open up, and up close the door. That is cool. But anyway, now since I'm outside, you guys can see it clearly rained last night. But it's still a very sunny day today. I'm very happy. It's a good day for filming. Anyway, talking about more about the bikes. So this bike we're getting ready to put up for sale, or about to put this in the garbage. So if you guys are willing to buy this bike and maybe fix it for yourselves, and maybe hopefully it'll work for you guys. Hey guys, go ahead and go give it a shot. <laughs> tell me in the comments section down below if you guys would if you guys would buy this car. Then tell me. Or not the car. If you guys would buy this bike, tell me. Maybe fix it up a little bit. Now the information on the Schwinn. So the Schwinn is not gonna get fixed probably not till 2022 for a couple of reasons. But um somebody keeps sending me messages. That's right. Come on, sorry, girl. Yeah, that's what I thought. Come on, outside. So we just put back up the flags. We took them down two days ago because it was gonna rain. Because it rained yesterday. Actually, I think I might have took them down Wednesday. And right now we decided to go and put them back up. And now they're flying again, like they should be. North Carolina and Kentucky. But anyway, back to the house. As we are going to go ahead and spill. Look how beautiful the day today is. It's a beautiful day. Where's Annie at? Where's the puppy at? There she is, right there. Annie, I'm gonna let you in. I'm gonna let you in, okay? I'm gonna let you in, all right? Yeah, go on in. Well, it looks like the SS is gone. Don't know where they took the SS, but I should have, wherever they went, I wish I could have went with them. So now I'm here in a fully open, fully open, Driveway. The only cars we took out here now with us now the 1998 Corvette C5, the 1986 CV C4 Corvette, and also the 2018 Chevy Malibu. And I and like I will admit, I hope you guys like. Oh, look at there. 
Well, if you give to anyway, he going. Uh, I think you know, I hope you guys like my new setup. So, uh, like a little while ago, I posted it on my Instagram. We actually lined up all of our cars, hop on here on the grass here, and I took a, I took pictures of it. From, I took pictures of it from many angles. And speaking of which, if you guys haven't yet followed me on my Instagram, I will leave a link to it in the description down below. Um, I almost like I actually took many different pictures. A couple of them are popping up on the screen now. You can see right there, I took a bunch of pictures. I decided to pick one and edit it, so edit it a certain way. And then I then I decided to go and make that be my banner. Because, by the way, guys, I got a brand new computer. If I'm just going to show up one side here and show you guys what my new computer looks like. So, so if you come over here, this is my new computer. It's a Dell. This is my brand new computer. I'm going to be adding end screens and cards to my videos with this computer. So I'm not gonna go fully in depth because right now I got something I gotta go do on Forza Horizon 4. So anyway, back up, sir. Two minutes and 53 seconds until Forza Horizon 5 and I'm using my Performante. Now we have another flag. It's like a U.S. Air Force flag. And we got U.S. Air Force flag, North Carolina flag, and Kentucky. Nice. You know for a fact that's gonna be a good day when we have donuts. Oh yeah. Just finished eating my donut. Now, who knows what we're going to do now. I don't know if we're going to be doing anything else in today's vlog. Because for a couple of reasons. You know, I've been asking my parents if we're going to be doing stuff with the Corvettes today. Or any of the cars today. And they told me no. But I still have to get a daily vlog out for you guys. Today's currently Friday. I mean, I still got to get my video edited. End screened. Card. Carded. And everything else and real quick i do have a little bit more important news to tell you guys i do actually have a second microphone and this way the one i was using currently i'm not currently using it right now as you guys see it's not on my shirt but the thing is though i do have another one coming it's it's gonna like this like the one i got now it's just temporary it's supposed to get here next tuesday or wednesday and i'm very excited for it so now information about the um, C4 Corvette and about its distributor. Now, this, now, now like, the distributor of the C4 probably will not be here probably probably for another couple weeks. Or well, at most another couple weeks. It's going to get here. It's, it's going to probably be here within, uh, within the next couple weeks. But it's going to hopefully be here pretty soon. And I will get a video, guys. I will get a video of, of this. I'll be also some applying it, guys. Because we will also be test driving it afterward. Because the distributor is actually going to make the Corvette faster. So this C4 right now is only limited to around 85 miles an hour. I bet you could, we could probably could probably make it go maybe around 100 miles an hour if we're lucky. As it is an 86 C4, like it's not expected to be that fast. But boy, is it fun to ride in! It's incredible. Still not funner than the GTR I rode in a couple a couple months ago, a few months ago. But I still think it's pretty cool to say the least. Me to let you in girl okay come on in girl yes 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 we got this right here my new microphone permanent permanent microphone so it says here it's going to take it about so it says it right here it's going to take about two hours to charge and it's currently 325 right now and i'm going to go ahead and wait this for this thing to charge up anyway let's go ahead and take this thing out and let's go and take a look at this I'm pulling it out now there we go so let's go and get these this is, looks like a little manual thing i'm gonna put that out of the way so in that box itself, it looks like it comes with two cards. Do not know what those do. It comes with those, like the charger. And we also got the headset itself wrapped inside of this. It actually feels pretty, huh? I'm gonna take the rest of this out oh, just by doing this. And there it is, guys. This is what I'm gonna be using for my videos from here on out. This thing is sick. Is your mom in the coolest? Yeah. <laughs> That's true. And there, and there we go. Now we're gonna the chargers. Now, we put this in this box and put, go plug this in upstairs in my room. And now we go plug this thing in and wait for about two hours and then try this thing out. All right, so now I'm just going to plug this in. So now, to plug this thing in, there's a little switch right here. Probably you gotta pull back and there's the charging port. And the charger that comes with, I guess, the charger that you wanna use. And there we go, so now it's plugged in. I'm pretty sure this light will turn blue when it's charged. Well, that there ain't a good sign. I accidentally realized my, to the root, the lid to my Gatorade was not open always. So now I gotta come 
And uh, I think here. No, not there. Um, where is it? In here? Right here. Grab myself a rag, or you know what? That's wash racks, you know what? I'm gonna get myself a paper towel things. I don't even have any paper towels in this house because of the COVID-19. Anyway, let me get down here and check real quick because I don't know for sure now where paper towels. Right there. Paper towels, let's go. But now, oh dang it. I now got stuff all over my bed. But that's fine. As long as as long as I was able to pick up my Gatorade, that's fine. But anyway, time to finish eating. Okay, so now I just got now the thing is still charging. Uh, it should be done by around 545. And I've just finished got done playing the piano for after a very long time before I turn that thing off. Oh, there we go. And now there's something else that I must do around the yard first. So I will involve me in putting on my shoes. All right, now here we go. Let's go ahead and go down here now. Let's go and get ready. It's been a very long time since I've rode this thing. Gotta put it up here though. Second, mow the grass. There's one thing that most people will have to do around the yard, and that is that thing is mow the grass. All right, there we go. Let's get this started. Just got finished mowing the grass. Good news, we got the distributor for the C4, and we're just about to change it. So there's the regular distributor, and over here is the new distributor. So it's right here. I still have about an hour left until my um, until my thing gets charged. So from my um, until my um, what is it? Until my uh, microphone gets charged. Today must be the most action-packed vlog I've ever done in my I've ever done vlogging so far. But right now, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna try to start filming the process of us removing this alternator and putting in the new one. Hey guys, hope you guys enjoy. An old spark plug. Changing them out. Pretty cool. Anyway, we did just pull out the C5 Corvette. This is probably this is probably the most action-packed vlog I've ever done. I've done and I've done in my career so far. Apart from the time when we actually changed the oil of the C5 of the SS, that's actually one of my most popular videos now. For when we actually changed the oil to the Chevy Camaro SS. But anyway, we also still got to change the the um, windshield wipe. I also still got to get a new windshield for the Chevy Malibu because it still has that crack. But anyway, back up there to the C4. So now we just changed the spark plugs to the C4 on the on the on the driver's side. Now we're about to work on the left of a, on the passenger side. A fresh spark plug removed. And now, no, actually, I mean it's running pretty good. I mean, and a second spark plug removed. Put these right here. All right, now it's have time to put the new ones in. Got more spark plugs right here. And there we go. We got some fresh spark plugs here's what a brand new spark plug right here looks like so we're about, to, we're about after we get rid of out after we get out all the two all the other four on the other side he will then be ready to apply these new ones so here this is what the inside of a spark plug looks like tell them why because i dropped it yeah because i accidentally dropped it I dropped the spark plug, and now we can see what it looks like inside. It is pretty cool, though. Now we're just about to take out the distributor. Right here, we just pulled out the little rubber pieces that connect to it right here. So now we're going to go ahead and get ready to take this one out and put the new one in. The distributor has now been removed. Now it's time to put in the new one. Now that the distributor cap has now been or the actual distributor part has actually now been removed. Now about to put in this new one right here. And they couldn't have to, have to put those, the new distributor cap on top of this and then put these little pieces on. And have to put those little rubber pieces on those pieces. So we have a little bit left to do until this car is finally change it out and after that we may take it for a test ride afterward not saying we will but we may we have to wait and find out now we got the distributor part here done on finally we got the um the full 
distributor onto the C4. And now we just put the cat back on top of the distributor and now we're about to start her up and see how she runs. We're just about to take the C4 Corvette out for his next test run. Is it going to feel faster or is it going to feel about the same? Yeah, we just got, there's only one way to find out. I accidentally revved the C4 too loud. Okay, here we go. Getting inside the seat for now. now. Let's get that going. Like it always almost, like it always almost is. It's for real, it's like, like, I can't believe how low this thing is as well. This thing's incredibly low. All right, the ride in the C4 Corvette again after we just replaced its distributor was an incredible blast the car does feel a tad bit quicker but unfortunately i'm gonna have to go and end this video right here if you guys did enjoy please do leave a like and subscribe also guys go follow me on my instagram snapchat and facebook if you guys want to go see behind the scenes of what what i'm doing right before i'm filming so you guys will be able to get a little bit of a hint of what the next video is going to be about and also and also and also please make sure you guys go check out the so far only one shout out today he um like his name will be popping up right here like right there right there if you guys want to go see it it's popping up right there so anyway guys thank you all so much for watching peace open out you open up hit you on baby m we should be closer than friends if you open up engaging you's on my agenda request my chariot get ya